Talking to kids about the facts of life has always been a tough gig for parents. But let's face it, our world has changed. Growing up in the 21st century is a hyper-speed experience. Oh, pimples, I think, happen when you, like, have so much face um, oils and, yeah. like... And it's up to us as parents to protect and prepare our kids as best we can. Are you at a man stage yet? No. Hell yeah. <laughs> So, we asked a group of very brave mothers and fathers and their curious kids to sit down and talk through some of life's biggest and most awkward lessons. With thanks to Nature's Way, giving your kids a healthy start with Kids Smart, today our parents are talking to their kids about puberty. <coughs> Hello, Vanessa. <laughs> Welcome to our discussion about puberty. We're now talking about puberty. Can you stop snorting? <laughs> what does puberty mean to you? <laughs> what do you think? OK. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's when your body changes. You become a not kid, a man. Are you at a man stage yet? No. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when you came to the bathroom the other day, and you said to me you had something on your face. What was that? Oh, yeah, a moustache. <laughs> well, that's when pu puberty starts, when that sort of stuff starts happening. Jackson, how are you? what are your thoughts on puberty, considering you are in the midst of it? I absolutely hate it. Why? My face. What about it? It's got pimples all over it. Mm. Boys get pimples. And, and I get pimples. That's right. So, pimples. so pimples are, are a sign of puberty as well. Oh, pimples, I think, happen when you, like, have so much face um, oils and, yeah. like... Amazing. So what do you think you should be eating to control the okay, pimples? I, I looked it up because I'm sick of hearing this. <laughs> Don't eat chocolate, you'll cause you pimples. Don't eat bad food or cause you pimples. I looked it up. It's not a dietary thing. Yes, it is. Where'd you get that off, BuzzFeed? No. Yeah. I don't watch BuzzFeed. You get all this crap information off BuzzFeed. No, I, I don't. God. Yes, you do. Who, no, I don't. Forget the BuzzFeed. Okay. I know this isn't a favorite topic of yours, but, but boys, boys. I hate you. <laughs> and what about their bodies? The girls' bodies, have you noticed? Is it anything noticeable? Or do you, have you noticed anything? Like, is it drawing your attention to changes in their bodies? So you don't, you don't find yourself, like, thinking they're funny and cute? They're really annoying. Yeah, but, That's what yeah, them but, funny. but that never changes, right? Even as men. They're really annoyingly funny. funny. Annoyingly funny? You like me? No, you're just really annoying. Oh. How are you... What about your, your feelings, like, and your... My feelings. <laughs> My feelings. Seriously. You puberty, like, your hormones, your hormones are, changing, are taking your over you. Change. Yeah, your hormones are just taking over you and you're not the boy you used to be and with the feeling situation. Are you more sensitive? That doesn't that doesn't happen to me. Like because I think it's because I go to a boys' school where everyone just like uses banter to communicate. Like we no one takes anything seriously. And when you get older too, your hormones are gonna change. Yeah. Mm. But then that's when you'll start. You'll probably be more interested in girls and stuff. Yeah. And you can always talk about that with mum or dad. It's like uh, chemicals in your body. When are you gonna start? You haven't started any fluff on your upper lip yet. I wonder where I that's gonna come. Armpit hair either. All right. Well, you got these things to look forward to hair in other parts of the body. The only thing I'm looking forward to is chest hair. <laughs> <laughs> so Cute. a girl can run her fingers through it? Oh. <laughs> yes. 